We're counting down to the Olympic Games with the opening ceremonies just being a few days away. And right now we are at Kingsman Arena, highlighting probably one of the most beautiful Olympic sports, figure skating. Here with me is Tammy Paul, one of the Red Deer Skating Club's coaches. So Tammy, what goes into competing competitively with figure skating? Well, they start a guy like, or a girl like Amy, that you're going to be looking at here. It's someone who started when she was about four skating. Lots of them start, we take our little guys in at three and that's when our preschools start and when they decide whether what, maybe what facet of skating they want to go in, um, speed skating, power skating, hockey skating or figure skating, they choose that. They usually make that choice by five or six and then they start in a pre-star skate program and it's, it's just an introduction to the actual figure skating. And then we take it from there, and they, that's usually a two day a week. Then they start into three and four days and five days, and the competitions become um, more advanced as time goes on. Now, Amy is a competitive A skater, so she's an elite athlete, oh. and she has um, amazing <laughs> potential. So for a skater in the Red Deer Skating Club, how, do, how does one learn to jump high, spin fast, all, all of that good stuff? And, and the, we, we start with them little, and we start with the, just baby steps, little jumps, little spins. They have to really, really want it, because for every jump that they start to land, there's probably, especially when they get into more than one rotation, it probably takes thousands of falls to get one on their feet. So you've got to be relentless. And uh, as an athlete, you know, figure skating is so beautiful, but there's a lot of athletics that go into that. Um, Amy was telling us a little bit about her schedule, but what is the schedule like for a figure skater? Early mornings um, and after school, and usually six days a week when they start to become an elite athlete. For little guys, like we said, they start out with two days and then build up from there. But, um, and then there's off-ice stuff involved. There's off-ice, there's land training, dance training, so it's uh, all around, you have to be pretty dedicated. So for people who are maybe, you know, wanting to be the next Canadian Olympic figure skater and they want to get involved in the Red Deer Skating Club, what do they need to know? They need to get in touch with our club, um, skateredgear.com. Um, just look us up on the web and we will be glad to sign you up. They start in Can Skate and go from there. Great. Well, it's been a great education learning all about figure skating and what it really takes to be great. So if you're ready to check out and be the next athlete in figure skating, check out the website for the Red Deer Skating Club.